I'm over here in Elk City. This devil lord converts to, to sistop mode. Instead of go hop, he speak the word of Mahal, the great God Almighty. Of course, got the call about Harvey. And my mother in law told me. And uh, my plan, you know, Proverbs 21 to 1, I'm always saying this one. The king's heart's like a stream of water directed by the Lord, guides him wherever he pleases. You may want to go about your own path. Of course, that's what this word is all about. It's about our flesh want to do what it wants to do, but by the holiness of his spirit, he's going to guide his living water through you, whether you're a believer or not. If you're a believer, and obedience is better than sacrifice, you're going to have to sacrifice something. So I had to sacrifice my little plan. I was going to come up here Saturday instead of Friday. Uh, Friday, we went, uh, my Delaware tribe was giving away school supplies in Anadarko, and it wasn't just giving away to our Lenape people, they were giving away to all tribes. All you had to do was have your CDIB. So, of course, I told mother-in-law, let's hook up some toys. Was, all right. So we all had Kabbalah IDs and Delaware IDs. And we didn't have to wait. I hate dealing with my tribe, y'all. I don't know about y'all. But I get better dealing with the Cheyennes when I used to go to it at the complex with my sister Sherry and get my own people. My tribe's under some crazy leadership. I don't agree with them, but I was really happy that everything went smooth. We all got our backpacks. So there was a little bit of my plan out of the way. And then the girls that answered Kate here, mother in law asked, Are y'all going to go tonight? And before I could say anything, she goes, yeah, we're going. <laughs> and my mother, so there was 50% of my plan out of the way. And then, when we made it, I felt really good being here, of course. And Harvey, Harvey was good. Harvey gave me a good Bible before I went and bought my last flyer in Cherokee, North Carolina in 2009. He got to use that word. Some of the Comanches received it, but my best friend, who I'll be buried later on, under my follow-along, your brother, of course. He ran that service and I got to co-minister Jerry Friedman's funeral. I got my first taste of the funeral. Mother-in-law told me what to do. She instructed me. And, uh, so, it, it, uh, from there, here we come. And then, Bunny, you, I know you're a minister, you're a pastor, but in my flesh, once I heard you minister the word, I said, man, my boy got me hooked. <laughs> I'm staying. I got money. If I ain't got money, y'all got IBC right here. You see, Mahal was got to stream where he pleased. I was meant to be here for a harvest. Not just his, not just his wake before his funeral. You know what my pastor tells me? There's a lot of ministers that will go to the wake but not to the funeral. Can I get an amen on that? Amen. There are a lot of ministers that run from funerals when they ask them to do it. Well, what good is that? You know, we're not asking for nothing. The Lord gave you everything in the first place. Because I guarantee you, if your mom goes, your spouse goes, your aunt or your uncle or your best friend goes, who's going to help you? All right. Got riled up. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to go to James. I'm going to make this real quick. Are any of you suffering hardships? You should pray. Are any of you happy? You should pray. Are any of you happy? You should sing praises. Are any of you sick? I went to James 5 in the back. Yeah. 13. I'm going to read through to... Uh, it's kind of hard to see this. You should sing praises. Are any of you sick? You should call for the elders of the church to come and pray over you, anointing you with oil in the name of the Lord. Such a prayer offered in faith will heal the sick of the Lord will make you well. And if you have committed any sins, you will be forgiven. Confess your sins to each other and pray for each other so that you may be healed. The earnest prayer of a righteous person has great power and produces wonderful results. Elijah was as human as we are, yet when he prayed earnestly that no rain could fall, none fell for three and a half years. Yet when he prayed again, the sky sent down rain and the earth began to yield its crops. I'm going to go straight to Revelation to the very end. The very first chapter. 22, 1. Then the angel showed me a river with the water of life. Clear as crystal flowing from the throne of God and of the Lamb. It flowed down the center of the main street. On each side of the river grew a tree of life, bearing 12 crops of 